lost last week in Arlington at AT&T Stadium, 38-24. The kickoff to Deshante Jones by Jay Sedwick. And Deshante Jones running it out, ready to go today after Kyle Kemp hurt his shoulder last week. He'll hand the ball off so good that Mike Warren, he ran for over 1,300 yards two years ago, rarely won. That's where Taylor Young would be. Eight tackles for loss, three sacks this year. Hand off to Montgomery. This is third down. Deferred their option. The punt headed for Tony Nicholson from Colin Downing. Nicholson, the sophomore, he ran for 623 yards. Here's a throw, or at least looking to throw Charlie Brewer, but there's nowhere to throw to. Defensive end positions. Great last week. He's from Jacksonville, Florida. Five sacks this year. A cut to the outside and a run down the sideline. Then Hasty. And Hasty stays on his feet and stays in bounds. After reviewing the play, the runner stepped out of the 22 yard line. There is no running back now after Hasty's 41 yard run. He'll go over into the slot on the left side. Brewer is throwing for the end zone. Defended this year. That was his seventh. Here's a quick throw to Hasty. Hasty in space. And lose tackles. It's here to get this first down. Third and three, Brewer standing in the pocket. Now flushed. Fourth and one. Play fake, roll, throw. Ish Wainwright, the catch, 10, five, huh. touchdown. Ryan noted two touchdowns for Wainwright. Those are his only two catches. For basketball players. Kick off Jay Sedwick. Deshante Jones, rather than Landon Akers, returning kicks today for Iowa State. Jones, his run back starter at the beginning of the season. David Montgomery running the ball. The Baylor defense, the coordinator is Phil Snow, and the ball is out. Season is one. Iowa State has not lost a fumble this year. They got back on that ball. The final home game at McLean Stadium. 19 seniors recognized today. Punt by Colin Downing. Wow. That wind just knocked that ball down. Punt. Baylor is starting at the 49, and they're going to run a reverse. And this might be a chance for Jared Atkinson. It looked like he was thinking about throwing, but instead, he'll follow it. Atkinson has thrown one pass this year for 20 yards. Now, middle linebacker, Lanny, number seven. That's their 77th tackle for loss this year. Here comes late pressure from Lanning. Season for the Cyclones. Any pressure on the Connor Martin punt. Not a very good punt, angling out of bounds. The Cyclones on offense at their own 35. A quick throw to Deshante Jones. He ran out of one. Freshman James Lynch ran him down from behind after a three-yard pickup. Here's a cutback run. David Montgomery. This is an underneath handoff here. And a drop pass by Deshante Jones. Been through a lot. Nolan will pitch it. Montgomery. Montgomery. Cutting back in toward the middle of the field. And Iowa State leads the nation on percentage of third down plays that are passes. And they're looking to throw, and it's outside. To Iowa State. Never wanted to lose it from Temple. 18th catch of the year. Now Nolan going up top. Nolan throwing it for the end zone. 26 yards to pass. Todd Blythe to be the all-time leader in receiving yards. Civically, always responds. 46 straight games with the reception for Lazard. From the goal line on the kickoff, bobbled by Trevor White. Turns and picks it up and runs to the sideline. At the FCS level, winning 60 games in nine seasons at Youngstown State. And a big hole for John Lovett. Bunch of injuries, but healthy is a good prospect. Was tackled by Reggie Wilkerson, who's third on the Iowa State defense. On what is officially second and seven. And love it to do that anymore. They will throw it, and quickly, and underneath. Going into today, three tight ends have caught five passes this year for Baylor. And that was a three-yard run for Lovett. They fake it to Lovett. Brewer throws. Matt Rule believes his team's improving. Brewer standing in the pocket, throwing up top. Originally from Ocala, Florida. Brewer going to keep it, spins out of the tackle. The freshman from Lake Travis High School. Officially, he ran for two yards, third and eight. He steps up out of the pocket. He eludes the rush, and he slides. Got away from Ray Lima, who was providing pressure up the middle on the 10th play of the drive. It's a throw. It's a catch. Blake Lynch. Well, today. He has six pass breakups. Fuerbacher is playing receiver. And it's why Hasty is lined up sometimes this year. Brewer, a pass. 16 receiving yards on this drive for Furbacher. Now another throw on third down. 
And they're going forward on fourth and one, and Hasty Baylor's staff has more NFL experience than any college coaching staff. Another run for Hasty, no, it's a fake. And Brewer escapes the pressure. It's a long five from just inside the 10. Brewer throwing in zone. Including three this season. Field goal try by Connor Martin extends the lead. Baylor just had their longest drive of the year, 19 plays, converting a field goal. Then a kickoff. Free kick out of bounds on the kicking team. After the play, personal foul. Receiving team. For the Cyclones, and as we said earlier, will get sent off with a chance to go to a bowl. Julian Good-Jones, the snap to Nolan. It's going to affect these young kids going down the road. Back to throw, Nolan lobs it up. With the catch. Yep. Montgomery running play. Decimated by injuries to begin. And has played as many young players, underclassmen, as pretty much any team in the nation. To the last non-conference game against Duke, and since then, Baylor's third down defense is at 33%. Sixth of the day for him. Play fake, throwing again, and incomplete. Suffered from lack of confidence last week. Compared him when he walked onto the field. Iowa State has converted on third down. One time throwing to Lazard. One time throwing to Eaton. Now the shovel pass, and it's Montgomery. To the position to make that play, they just make the tackle. Run for Montgomery, not much. Nine rushes, just 30 yards for him today. They fake it to Montgomery. They throw it out on the left side. Landing, running. Threw a touchdown pass last week. To Lazard. Lanning will tuck the same season. Zeb Nolan now back in at quarterback on second down. Throwing up. Nolan to throw. Toward the sideline. Long is 42. Transfer from Oregon State from Arroyo Grande. Garrett Owens kickoff. I'm sorry, Chris Francis with the kickoff. And they're trying to fix their defense. And so in conference play is Baylor for Baylor today. Brewer on second down after the fumble throws underneath. Committed to what they're doing. Only four penalties for 36 yards a game. Here's Hasty, nowhere to go. Caught it at the 10. Run by Connor Martin. And held up in that win. Left. Running play Montgomery. That Matt Campbell had no interest in delving into this week when we spoke to him. As the they had great field position after the short punt, and no, most. Third three and out today for Iowa State. Colin Downing wants to pin Baylor. Tony Nicholson, fair catch. 1,000 receiving yards this year. Has not caught a pass today. Climb and stay busy. That was their third tackle for loss today. Brewer throws, and we just mentioned the name of Denzel Mims. A receiver. Go for 1,000 yards. Mims from danger field. An open quite frequently. Tied at FBS for third most yards per play. 14, they lost yardage on the first snap. 306 pounds of Ray Lima. Bailey pressuring Brewer on the rollout. Ineligible receiver downfield. Offensive. First penalty today for Baylor, as a matter of fact. And negates what would have been Blake Lynch's second catch of the day in 13. Beat the Woodlands out of Houston. Third down and long. The penalty really has hurt the drive. Third and 17, and Brewer can't escape. 27-yard punt into the wind earlier. It is a stiff breeze. He's able to knife this one through the wind by the Michigan State Spartans. So that punt puts Iowa State at their own 32, and a long pass throw. Oh, what a catch. Hakeem Butler. Butler caught it up against his shoulder, and then breaks tackles. 74 yards and 67 yards for the freshman. In his first start, he's gone 9 for 18, 166 yards in addition. Now Baylor trailing for the first time today. Brewer, no one to throw to in that double cloud. You can see here as he finds a scrambling lane. And ran it up to the 36, gain of 11. Brewer throwing, caught, Mims. And his throw to Mims gains 15 yards for Baylor. They keep it moving. First down in this drive. And the Cyclone 49, a step up. The assignments are freshman to sophomore position. Brewer to throw after Bill Porter limps off. And Brewer puts it right between the one. Matt Rule actually brought that up as we see the punt here and a rush on the punt. 
and a fair catch is going to be made. A win today assures Iowa State of their first winning season since 2009. They come in today at 6-4. and four. They appear poised to take the lead going into the locker room at halftime. At some point in time, this play will be blown dead. Yeah. And once again, already a big leg, just under 20 points per game allowed per Big 12 Conference game, is second best throw to Denzel Mims. Mims had a slow start today, but he's coming to life. Late in the second quarter, caught Baylor trying to maintain a winning streak in this series. They've won the last four. Lead the series all-time 9-6. Pass interference. Defense. Penalty today against Iowa State. They average only four game fewest in the Big 12. Brewer bumped by Lanning as he throws it, and he underthrows it. Pass interference. Defense. Drawing that penalty. Now 45 yards in penalties today. Forced Brewer to throw an incomplete pass. John Lovett running the ball, second down and 10. Forced to the outside, stiff arm against Bryant. Tackles for loss now. Back to throw Brewer underneath Hasty, third and 14 in Iowa State. Where you see it is higher up. The kick by Good Connor play. Martin, and he has. Let's see what kind of leg strength Martin has here on the kickoff. To the one yard line. Back to the 20, Amici Walker, who had started six games this year, went out last week against Oklahoma State with a shoulder injury. That's why Nolan played last week. He's at 12 carries, 43 yards today. Swerve missed tackles that he's forced today. Montgomery's third straight run. Stutter steps, lowers his head. Pretty shot. Tayon Sells finally tackled him. Now a throw! Play clock winding down to two seconds. Running play, Montgomery, one tackle, broken two. Good run for Montgomery to the Baylor 43. And they'll call. At the 40, play fake throw, Trevor Ryan has Akeem Butler blocking in front of him and also... Nolan looking in the top 15, as you saw. And they'll swing it out, and Crony catches! His three-yard reception. On third and on fourth and three, I'm sorry, that sustains the drive. He remembers that move. Hand off Montgomery. Montgomery, it opens up for him. There he goes. Good run support. Go out of the tackle of Vaughns. And then at the end. Vaughns ran up and hit him hard, but Montgomery ran through the tackle. And they'll flare it out again for Trevor Ryan. And Ryan tells us that before the Kansas game earlier this year. You could you could really see that as Tech and Fuis to the Big 12. Now at the 10-yard line. It's been a steady diet. 100 on the button. 19 carries to get there. Running play, land ramp package. Iowa State at the five. Nolan looking to throw. Puts it towards the back corner. The youngsters, freshmen and sophomores, and seeing when the light goes on. Kick off Chris Francis. No wonder why he acts like he's been here before. Oh. Looped out on the right side. Good throw. Had a good throw to Nicholson. Six minutes left in the third quarter. Now it is a deep pass. Career and his dad, Robert, told me Charlie is actually the most like him. Not the biggest guy, but he can run. And he's finding some lanes to throw it through. Excited about him on the defensive side of the ball. Michael Hasty running. There's a jump cut. Big play, third and six. Oh, they come after. A touchdown. And they throw it right at the 40. So you beat the blitz. Hand off to Hasty. He played a lot against Texas earlier this year. And he's going to run. And he had a crease. Right now is Josh Malin. Mo Porter went out earlier in the game with an injury. And they run. They need a yard at the Iowa State 30. And they are really close. Ball start. Offense. Wainwright has a touchdown reception today. Furbacher's caught three passes. Here's Brewer throwing. And he throws it to the big. That's his fourth. At the Iowa State 26, running is Hasty and eluding a tackle. Hasty coming toward the sideline. Moving on from the 15, Brewer stands in the pocket. Brewer running. Slide. Baylor knocking on the door, looking for a tying touchdown late in the third quarter. Hasty, two thirds of his pass is completed today. Will he go to the air here on third down and short? He does. It's caught. Seventh catch of the year for Lovett. 
And it's Lovett now running the ball for the ninth time today. And nowhere to go. He tried to run behind. Balls Kyle out. Boy, the fullback. The ball is out. Iowa State says they have it. And that was another stop and another red zone turnover for the nine. Montgomery. Driven back. Lost a fumble. Unbelievable number. Standing in the pocket and throwing. Colin Downing from Whitefish Bay, Wisconsin, has to kick it into the wind. Tony Nicholson waving for a fair catch. But has a comfortable lead over Kansas at halftime. Running, hasty. Couple of defenders have missed. Michael Hasty's already had a gaining ground as he keeps getting further to the sideline. Here's another run. This one to the left. But they're going to back off. Talking about the left tackle, Mo Porter. Line has started eight straight games together. With today's starting assignment, this is a lateral back to Hasty with the defensive secondary fit every day in practice. And Jake from Morgan from Clemson is that tackle that you're talking about that maybe they're starting left tackle next year. And the all start penalty didn't help things out at all either. Leading by seven. And they want Montgomery and their ground converting right now against Montgomery ran for six. Montgomery spinning. All right, Greg, here in Waco, we see a running play for Montgomery again. And Montgomery, and he's such a specialist at making people miss tackles. Under the nine-minute mark, Sheldon Crony. And Crony, oh, they're just gashing that Baylor defense. Crony stays in after the 11-yard run. For the first time on the drive, looking to throw it, and it's for Lazard. Pass interference. Defense. Montgomery is back on the, on the field, 28-yard line of Baylor. The depth up front. Nowhere to go this time. 5 of 12 on third down. Nolan under pressure. Throws the ball and hit from over 50 yards in his career. Transfer from Oregon State. And this is a 45-yard boot. And it's a beauty. Aaron Owens has hit three field goals today. And Francis. To Trevor White at the one-yard line. A return by White. Fought off a tackle of the 20. TCU didn't score a point against this defense this year. Flares it out to Hasty. Caught it on the move. Iowa State team, they tackle well. And as we see Brewer throw for the 31st time, average of well over eight yards, but they only have a two yard gain they need, and they have that two yard gain and more. High school, get the plays out quickly. Late pressure from the spy, Joel Lanning. Hasty for Oklahoma this year, it would seem that it's his Heisman to lose right now. Underneath, Hasty. First down will stop the clock. The guy to go to. Love it is the running back. He stays in, chips a defensive lineman, stepping up for the 41 from Waco, Midway High School in Waco. Brewer is six for six on the drive. No, he throws an interception, no. It is picked off by Reggie Wilkerson and a run back outside the 35 and down he goes. <laughs> Going to see a lot of this, Baldy. David Montgomery running. And Crony with the run, and slashing off the left side, fresh legs coming in, and Crony, that went for 25 yards. Game still to play, the Farmageddon matchup against Kansas State, and then whatever bowl game. They have a third and nine. Baylor's got to get a stop and get the ball back. Sheldon Crony had the Baylor 29 to put the game away. Lanning running it, and 100 on the season for Northern Illinois. Joel Lanning running, and Lanning, and the reason that their number of plays today, they've run 65 plays today, it's 773. He's changed positions to be the starting middle linebacker. And now it is definitely a first down. Because of an accident. Iowa State will savor the flavor of a winning season for the first time in eight years.